how it's going to be cool. We're going to vlog it. It's going to be Jason and Claire's first taste of proper Filipino food. They've had some snacks, I would say. They've had some Philippines mango so far. Had a little bit of beef tapa this morning at breakfast, but they haven't yet delved in to the cuisine, shall we say, of the Philippines in terms of, I don't know, adobo, sinigang, all our favorite kind of foods that we like to eat out here. We're gonna get the chance to share that with them. Wow, Koda, this way, come and look at the beach. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. So we've come back down for dinner. I say back down, we're literally staying on the beach. Oh, this is so beautiful. Look behind me. You can just hear these like crows. I think they are in the trees. There's quite a lot of birds, quite a lot of wildlife here. Smell the ocean and not much else is going on. It's just so peaceful. The silhouettes of the mountains and the amazing sunset behind. I hope you can see that well. I think it looks better in real life. It always looks kind of washed out on camera, but in real life it's this really deep orange and there's just amazing palm trees. Oh, there's some stars in the sky. It's just amazing. We're going for dinner now. Got changed quickly, had a quick shower, put lots of off lotion on because, um, yeah, Koran is quite known for bad mosquito bites. Um, so yeah, being quite careful, but wow, the stars, like I'm seeing so many stars in between all these palm trees. I think I need to quickly take another phone photo of the stars because it's definitely good for stargazing here. Just so clear, no pollution. I just speechless, totally speechless. Have you got off on? Yes. Uh, yes. Good. Have a lot of off on. Look up as well, the stars. There's no pollution here. Oh, so if you look up for a while and adjust your eyes. Missed mm. the other uh, sunset, like the latest uh, sunset. We yeah. revised on it's too late. Tomorrow, we'll make sure we're down there for a bit longer. Yeah. Because Philippine sunsets are pretty Amazing. world famous, but actually Brakai is the best. So, so long as we see some there, we're good. But um, that was a very nice sunset. Yeah, it was very anyway. nice. Nice swim. Now good time colour. for dinner. Great. Lovely swim. Nice pool as well. Kids pool's yeah. really warm, yeah. which is nice. Yeah, I just need to get myself down the slide. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know and I'll make sure I'm recording. Yeah, Please yeah. don't do it without me. Do that, yeah. <laughs> I need to test, test myself. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're at dinner now. The place for dinner is called. Does anyone know the name of this rest restaurant? No. Well, it's the only one, only one choice on the re on the island. There's only one um, restaurant. Um, so we've decided to get a chicken, a pork, a beef, and a sizzling dish, so we can try and share some stuff. We've already chosen our beef dish, which is the, the salpicao rice. Then we're gonna get some chicken dish. My dad's just said he fancies a lechon kawali because we have spoken about lechon an awful lot to them. And I think it's gonna be really good. I feel like island in the heat, you want some greasy food. I don't know what it is, but I quite fancy that too. We need to decide on the chicken. So we've got inner sal, we've got adobo, and we've got some international dishes as well here. So we could mix it up, but um, I'm not sure what you fancy for the chicken. Has anyone got any chicken ideas? He chose the pork, I chose the beef. So okay. Do you, you choose the chicken. Okay, let me have a look. Or I can choose the chicken and you choose the sizzling. We can get, we can get a sizzling. Yeah. It's a bit of like a wild card option. Do you think? I don't know. It's pig's face. Yeah. Which you just would never get in, in the UK. True. Depends if you're up for trying it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, good, there you go, nice. Okay, so we're up for trying some sisig. Absolutely. Okay. All right, let's do that. We've got pork already, haven't we? Oh, yeah. We're going lechon. Oh, true. Okay. Very, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. very, very different dishes as well. Yeah, right. very different. Okay. Yeah. And then chicken, I don't know if to go for adobo or the inner salt or the barbecue chicken. Yeah, but it could be, I've made you adobo, but it might be different. different. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the barbecue chicken could be really nice. Do barbecue and chicken. Oh, no, it's like barbecue sauce. That's not really Filipino at all. Oh, that's no. Just like do the inner salt. I think the inner sal is going to be good. Right. It will be. It will be different. And then, well, because on the island they'll cook it on the island. Yeah, it'll, it'll be, be different. different. Above the chicken kebab. No, above the chicken kebab. There's a lot of words in there I can't read. That's got to be Philippine, isn't it? Traditional. Hang on, let's do it a bit. I don't know. It's the first Filipino dish we've True. True. And it was in Palawan. It's right? the Filipino dish. Okay. Yep. Adobo. And then Koda will get him some spaghetti. Did you say chicken adobo. Big adobo. Yeah. some lechon kawali, some chicken adobo, some pork sisig, and then, oh, I never pronounce it, I always forget how to pronounce it. Sao Pachau, Sao Sao Pachau, Sao Pachau, with like garlic, we've got garlic rice, we've got steamed rice, and it's 
I've cooked them Filipino food. That was their first try. I, I don't think it's true Filipino food if I've cooked it because I'm not Filipino. I tried my best. But <laughs> this is their first official taste of Filipino food. Dad's going straight in with the sisig. Players on the beef. Just having a go, you know? Uh, Friday. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Sisig's good. Mm, I had that breakfast tonight. Oh, no difference. Similar. Similar. Oh, good. Really? Oh, my God. <laughs> Speaking of garlic rice, it's amazing. Oh, yeah, garlic rice is really good. Mm. Are you glad I ordered for you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, got, I persuaded them to uh, try some Filipino dishes tonight. I don't think you needed much persuasion. No, not much persuasion. <laughs> so, Dad was just asking if you should have it with rice or not. It's a very rich flavour, so you might want to cut it with the rice just to take the edge off. I personally think it's fine to have on its own. Like, I like how rich it is. But traditionally, yeah, you'd have it with rice, but it's up to you, really. We're going for the crispy skin, that's the best bet. Pork belly. Pork belly. It's the best of everything. Pork, crackling, pork belly. Yeah. Tasty. So you did have the top bit, did you? Here we go. It's really naughty, but it's so nice. Lovely. Eat that all night. <laughs> you can. You can have it three nights, yeah. For the next two weeks. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good one. Loads of flavour. That's the sissy. Sissy. So the pork face, pork, like lots of different parts. Pig's mask. Pig's so mask, yeah. yeah. All parts of it, basically. With a fried egg drop. Yes. Yeah. Not, what's not to like? <laughs> Fried onions, which is yeah. great. Pork is delicious. It's got millions of flavours. Yeah. Okay, we thoroughly enjoyed our dinner. I'm so glad Jason and Claire really enjoyed it. Claire said she couldn't decide whether the lechon kawali was the best or the sisig. She really liked both of those. Got massive lights on the beach, we're great for vlogging. Yeah, food's really, really good here. So at the Two Seasons Resort, I think we mentioned earlier, first impressions, unbelievable, amazing beach, staff are lovely, rooms are great and the food's good. So all we have to try is the coffee in the morning and tomorrow, and then we can give it a full juicy vlog review. Lucy and Coda having a little walk along the beach. We're gonna end off this vlog today. Thanks so much for watching. We have um, an island hopping tour. I'm not sure which boat. I'm like trying to look at the boats out here just to see what kind of boat we might be taking out tomorrow. And we're having a boodle fight on the boat. A little bit of island hopping, beach, a little bit of swimming, snorkeling. So make sure you come back if that's your kind of thing. You're gonna say bye to the vlog? Bye bye. So cool. We've seen like a massive crab that was like this big, blue, with big eyes popping wow, out. Wow, really? And Coda's been chasing the crabs down the beach. So if you look, oh. as you walk, hundreds of crabs dart across no you because way. they hear the vibrations in the sand. Wow. Um, so there's like hundreds of crabs right now. And also that boy just said, he said he saw a baby shark. Wow. So you can't swim at night here because of the baby shark. So yeah. We've just been collecting shells and throwing them back in the water. And but no, we look at that massive one. Did you see that? Oh, oh yeah. The there. Is that a shark? No, no, a crab. Oh, it's a crab. Do you think a shark was on the beach? There's a fish. There's loads of fish. Yeah, I mean, look right how there. clear the water is here. Loads of fish, actually. Yeah, but the crabs are so cool. Yeah, we saw the crabs. All right, guys, come back tomorrow for more crabs. Um, find more crabs. Until then, have a good one, whatever you're up to for the rest of the day. After watching this vlog, thanks again so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and we will see you very soon in the next. Where's the music? There it is. We'll see you very soon in the next juicy vlog. Goodbye. <laughs>